So welcome to the video. I'm gonna be tackling question 6b from the exam paper series we've been going through. Now this question is simplify eight times two to the power of six times two to the power of four. And we need to give our answer as a power of two. So the first thing I would do is tackle these twos. And because it's written as two to the power of six times two to the power of four, we can just add these powers. So we can write it in the form eight times two to the power of 10. This is true for anything that has the same base number or value and if they have different powers and then multiplied together, you know, you can add the powers together. Another way to look at it is, hey, if we've got two to the power of six and two to the power of four, it's just two times two times two, six times, and then two times two times two, four times. So you can just rewrite it as to the power of 10. So next line, let's rewrite eight times two to the power of 10, but we need to give our answer as a power of two. So luckily eight can be written as two times two times two, and then we're just gonna times that by the two to the power of 10. So when we add these powers together, we can see it's going to be 2 to the power of 13. And that's it. That's the answer. That's how you, you know, simplify it and then write it as a power of 2. If you weren't sure on any bits, you know, leave a comment down below and I'll get back to you there or make a separate video. And yeah, I hope it helped. Best of luck with your maths and stay tuned because we're going to be going through the rest of the paper. You can find it on a playlist on my homepage. And yeah, that's it. So best of luck with your maths. Thanks for watching.